एवरी वन वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग टू वन एंड आल वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल इन दिस वीडियो आई वुड लाइक टू गिव दि लेटेस्ट मॉडल क्वेश्चन पेपर फॉर दि ब्रिज को सैकेंड इयर स्टूडेंट्स इन बयोलॉजिकल सैनस लाइक ए बॉटनी अंड जुवालजी बॉटनी ट्वेंटी फाइव मार्क्स एंड जुवालजी ट्वेंटी फाइव मार्क्स पास मार्क्स ईच सब्जेक्ट नाइन नाइन मार्क्स सपरेट द क्वेश्चन पेपर विल कम इन वन पेपर बट यू शुड राइट इन सपरेट सपरेट बुकलेट्स ओके इफ यू राइट इन वन बुकलेट द क्वेश्चन द आंसर्स शीड इट मे नॉट बी वॉलिड यू आर द लूजर सो दट इज द रीजन Okay, so the uh, separate separate booklets you have to write the question and answers. Okay, so let me see one by one. In this video, just I will show the uh, like questions, and after that I will give the important like uh, according to question and answers also I will give in this video. So, so don't skip the video until the end. You have to watch that, and you will get the idea what is the question paper, what is the answers. In this video, you can came to know that. Okay, I requesting all the students please try to focus more on this video. So definitely you will pass. No need to worry about. I have given. Like it promises you people, not only vocational subjects. I will also deal the bridge course. Okay, whatever you have the doubts, please open and you have to give the like a uh, you have to give the question to me. Definitely, I will try to provide the uh, answers also. Okay, in this video, like a questions and after that I will give the answers also. Okay, if you like my video, you can support with super thanks. Already I have done the video regarding that. If you like my not only. putting the like if you like this video and all okay in like like dislike share and document i will be there in that column only i got the uh, like uh, recognition by the youtube uh, youtube team member super to, super thanks okay if you like my video you can support my channel by paying the 45 or 100 or 1000 or 200 also that is your wish i am not forcing to all the students but okay if you do the uh, work if you uh, put our efforts uh to the anyone but everybody uh, expect like recognition so if you do the work without cost or with there is no value for nobody will put the value nobody will give the respect that is the reason okay so that is the reason i am asking here okay if you do the work sometimes we need expectations also without expectations if you do there is no value for that okay i am not forcing i am not compelling i am not demanding okay if you want to support my channel you can use the super thanks okay already i have done this super like a one video you can go there then only you will get the idea so let me see one by one this is the questions and uh, okay in botany english and telugu version first i will show the answers in english so english medium students you can go through the questions Okay, section is very short answers. Like one more questions, they have given ten questions. Out of ten, you have to write any five. It's clear, na? So next to comment this section B. These are the short answers questions. Like four marks questions. Okay, you have to attempt to any five. In section B also ten questions they will give. Out of ten, you have to write any five. Separately, I have sh I will show the. Okay, this. These are the. Short answers questions, four marks questions. Out of ten, you have to write any five. It's clear, na? Okay. Let me will see the according to question. What the answers will be there? I am not explaining, but I will show the answers. It's clear. Okay. So let's tune on my video. We will see the one by one answers. Don't skip. Just wait with patience. See, then only you will get the clarity of the answers. Okay. My dear YouTube second year students, I am giving the answers in bridge course second years in botany. First, we will move on to the botany answers according to question paper. I have shown the question paper now. So the, again, I have given the question and answers. Who proposed induced fit hypothesis? These are the very very short answers. Like one more questions. Okay, induced fit hypothesis was proposed by the Daniel E. Coastland in the year of 1973. Who proposed Coastland? Next, coming to the what is first stable compound formed in a Clavin cycle? First stable compound formed in PGA PC. Okay. Next, what is the common pathway for aerobic and respiration? So, glycolysis. The it occurs in cytoplasm of the cell. Okay. What is the common pathway for aerobic respiration? Glycolysis. Okay. It is occurs in cytoplasm of the Cell. Next, coming to the what is the cross between the F1 progeny and the homozygous recessive parent called? Okay, test code. It is used to test whether an individual is two homozygous or heterozygous hybrid. 
ఓకే హోమోజైగస్ మీన్ ప్యూర్ హెడ్రోజైగస్ మీన్స్ హైబ్రిడ్ ఓకే దిస్ ఆర్ ది క్రాస్ బిట్వీన్ ద సో దే విల్ క్రాస్ ద ప్యూర్ టు హైబ్రిడ్ క్లియర్ ఓకే నెక్స్ట్ ఎక్స్ప్లెయిన్ ద టర్మ్స్ ఫోనో ఫీనోటైప్ అండ్ జీనోటైప్ ద ఫిజికల్ ఆర్ ఎక్స్టర్నల్ అపేరెన్స్ ఆఫ్ ది ఏ క్యారెక్టర్ ఇస్ కాల్డ్ ఫీనోటైప్ ఫిజికల్ ఆర్ ఎక్స్టర్నల్ అపేరెన్స్ ఆఫ్ ది క్యారెక్టర్ ఇస్ కాల్డ్ హ్యాస్ ఏ ఫీనోటైప్ ఓకే ద జెనెటిక్ మేకప్ ఆఫ్ అన్ ఇండివిజువల్ ఇస్ కాల్డ్ జీనోటైప్ సారీ ద ఫిజికల్ ఆర్ ఎక్స్టర్నల్ అపేరెన్స్ ఆఫ్ ది క్యారెక్టర్ ఇస్ కాల్డ్ హెస్ ఎ ఫీనోటైప్ బట్ జెనెటిక్ మేకప్ ఆఫ్ అన్ ఇండివిజువల్ ఇస్ కాల్డ్ ది జీనోటైప్ ఓకే ఓన్ అవుటర్ సైడ్ అపేరెన్స్ కాల్డ్ హ్యాస్ ఎ ఫీనోటైప్ బట్ జెనెటిక్ మేకప్ ఆఫ్ ఇండివిజువల్ ఇస్ కాల్డ్ హ్యాస్ ఎ జీనోటైప్ ఇట్స్ క్లియర్ so next what are the components of a, what are the components of a transcription unit prometer a prometer the structural gene and terminator these are the components of this transcription of the unit okay the transcription unit consisting of the three components that is a a promoter a structural gene and terminator next what is the function of the codon aug it has dual functions it codes for methionine and also act as a initiator initiator codon okay it codes for methionine and also act as a initiator codon next coming the how can you differentiate between exonucleases and endonucleases so here they have given differentiation here exogenous means outside endogenesis means inside okay they remove nucleotides from the ends of the dna they make cuts at specific locations with in the dna so in in the means in or inside the, or within the in dna so here ends of the outer side okay they remove the nucleus at the end of the dna so this is this is ending part so exogenous means at the end of the dna it will within the dna this is the answer differentiation between the endo and exo okay next what are molecular scissors molecular scissors are the restriction enzymes with cut the dna at specific locations usually they are obtained from bacteria okay these are the molecular scissors molecular scissors mainly what they will do these are the restriction enzymes within which cut the dna at specific locations usually they are obtained from bacteria next what are the fermenters they are large vessels in which microbes are grown in large numbers as on industrial scale okay this is one so i have finished the very short answers in section a for the bridge course second years in botany so let's we are moving on to the long answers sections b questions what are the physi- uh, physiological processes that are regulated by this ethylene in plants ethylene promotes the ripening of fruits okay ethylene what they will do it will mean easily it will promote the ripening of the fruits ethylene promotes the senescence and the absorption of the leaves and flowers ethylene breaks seed and bud do- dormancy initiates germination in peanut seeds and sprouting of the potato tubers ethylene promotes rapid internode and petiole elongation in deep water rice plants it also promotes root growth and root hair formation thus op- mm, helping plants to increase their absorption surface ethylene is used to initiate flowering and for synchronizing fruit set in pineapple seed promotes female flowers in cucumber seed by increasing the yield okay it's mainly whatever it may be it's mainly it will promote the ripening easily rap- ripening of the fruits next coming to the right physiological responses okay glibberins in plants glibberins uh, delay uh, senescence the fruit can be left on the reed sorry tree longer so as to extend the okay spraying the glibberins on sugarcane crop increases the length of the stem thus increasing the yield as much as 20 per acre ga hastens the maturity period of confers that leading to early seed production ga also promotes the bloating in cabbages wheat etc they also produce pathano corpic fruit in grapes and tomato glibberins flavor the favor the formation of female flowers in curcubita next variety a note on agriculture horticulture applications of the axins iba naa and ia help to initiate rooting in stem cutting widely used for plant propagation in horticulture axins like 24d 245 plus x 
as herbicides and skills broad leaved dicot weeds to prepare weed fruit free lands axins stimulates fruit growth example tomatoes axins induces flowering in plant prevents free harvest fruit drop also next third question explain the law of dominance using a mono hybrid cross cactus are controlled by discrete units called factors factors occur in plants in a mm, dissimilar pair of factors pertaining to a character one member of the pair dominates other the law of dominance is used to explain the excessive expression in on only one of the parent characters in a one hybrid cross in the f1 generation and the expression of both in f2 generation in the ratio of 3 to 1 define and design a test cross crossing between f1 individuals with the recessive parent is called a test cross it is used to test whether an individual is homozygous or heterozygous a mon hybrid test cross gives a phenotype ratio of 1 is to 1 and hybrid test cross gives a ratio of phenotype 1 is to 1 1 is to 1 okay like that heterozygous and hetero dwarf tall tall and dwarf okay recessive parent and gameter next f1 yellow round green wrinkled gameters yellow round yellow wrinkled green round wrinkled hybrid test cross this is the way next coming to what are the write the important features of the genetic code the code is triplet 61 codes code for amino acids and three codons do not code for the any any amino acids called stop on codons one codon codes for only one amino acid hence it is anonymous anonymous and specific some amino acids are coded by more than one codon hence they code is generated the codon is read in mrna is a contagious fashion they are no functions they are the code of nearly universal uu code for phenyl alanine in bacteria and humans aug has dual functions it codes for methanin and also acts as initiator code next one is a bright short notes on restriction enzymes two enzymes responsible for the restriction in the growth of the bacteria phase in echerichia coli were isolated in the year 1963 one of the added methyl group to dna and the other cut dna right the latter was called restriction endonuclease the first restriction endonuclease in in 11 which cut dna molecules hit a particular point by recognizing a specific sequence sequence of the six ways pair called recognition and sequence for hindu to today more than more than 900 restriction enzymes were isolated from over 200 strains of bacteria each of which recognize a different recognition sequence core is a restriction enzyme in which the first letter comes from the genes tracia and the second two letters from the species of the prokaryotic cell the letter r is derived from the name of the strain roman numbers indicate the order in which the enzymes were isolated from the strain of the bacteria restriction enzymes belong to a larger class of the enzymes called nucleases there are of two types okay exonucleus and endonuclease exo means outside endo means inside which remove nucleus from the end of the dna endo means within the dna next 18th question what are the different methods of insertion of recombinant dna into the host cells they are several methods of introducing the ligated dna into recipient cells recipient cells after making them competent to receive take up the dna present in their surrounding our dna can be forced into such cells by incubating the cells which are dna on ice followed by the placing them briefly at 40 degrees centigrade and then putting back on ice this enable the bacteria to keep the our dna in another method okay this are method pathogen vectors are used which when allowed to infect the cell transfer the our dna into the host 
what is the chemical nature of the biogas explain the process of the biogas production biogas is a mixture of the methylene co2 traces of the h2s and moisture it is generated by the decomposition of the excrete or drug of cattle domestic waste material and industrial and agriculture sewage due to the activity of the anaerobic bacteria methane coccus and methano bacillus present in them it is used to as fuel the bacteria which grow anaerobical on glucose material produce large amount of biogas and the bacteria are called methanogens methane bacterium commonly found in the anaerobic stage sludge during sewage treatment also present in the food of cattle and the rumen of the cattle in rumen this bacteria helps in the breakdown of cellulose and play an important role in the nutrition of cattle the excreted dung can be used for generation of biogas so last question is a okay gobar gas last one is a what are the bio fertilizers give two examples and discuss their role as bio fertilizers organisms that enrich the nutrient quality of the soil are called bio fertilizers bacteria fungi and cyanobacteria example bacteria in uh, symbiotic bacteria rhizogium is present in the root nucleus and legumes this bacteria example fix atmospheric nitrogen and into organic forms which is used by the plant as a nutrient other bacteria can be fix atmospheric nitrogen while free living in the soil are azospirium and azobacteria thus enriching the nitrogen content of the soil fungi the systematic asso- association between fungal members and root of vegetable plants is called mycorrhiza many members of the genes glomus forms by okay mycorrhiza the fungal symbiont in these associations will facilitates okay absorption of phosphorus by the plant from the soil plants keep having such association show resistance to root grown pathogens is uh, tolerance to salinity and drought and an overall increase in plant growth and development so till now i have given the complete answers uh, question and answers updating like 21 22 uh, latest question paper for the biological second year students the biological sciences only till now i have finished only botany so let's video we will moving on to the geology so thanks for watching my channel have a nice day and all the best once again hard work and get the success in your biological examinations also my dear students have a nice day